Hello, hello, this is George Prince again. I want to come to you live. And, um, I just want to, uh, pass on an observation I have. You know, I, being the way I am, I'm very open-minded. And, uh, I listen to a lot of different webinars. And, of uh, different people. And, um, I'll, you know, I do see a thread that goes through them. They're not always, you know, a lot of different people put on, you know, webinars or different testimonials with different companies. And that's the thing is that uh, is that no one particular business is what's going to quote connect with somebody. And it's true that I have an educational platform for which it has done for me, but not always is that going to work for everybody. You know, there's other businesses like Wake Up Now, ILN, uh, all kinds of different uh, companies, Brain and Buttons, you know, all different kinds of things. And that's the thing is that what I've realized is that it depends on who they came across and who was able to, you know, what resonates with them. They may not even know, but as long as they are connected with their passion and the reason why they want to better themselves, that's the key goal there. Because after that, the sky's the limit. And it doesn't really matter what business they join or didn't join, did actually, I mean, I've had members and, uh, you know, who have uh, members under me who have joined other businesses. And, uh, you know, financial, they didn't have the commitment, whatever, to keep up, and then they've joined another business. So, you know, and then they, they really floss them and take off. But is that a bad reflection on me? I come back to him and say, okay, you know, I'm glad you've succeeded. I mean, you're making good progress and everything, and uh, and so forth. And so, um, you know what they tell me usually is they say, oh, no, no. You know, they, they didn't, uh, you know, take off to another business because they disliked or had any problem with what I did or didn't do. It's because of me that they were finally on a path that they could focus on. Because, he says, without you, I've had different, all kinds of different testimonials. Without you, I would have just still be flying around not knowing what the heck was going on. I had no focus. No, you know, no way which to, I didn't even know what I was going or doing. Now I do. So, it's not a bad thing that people have different businesses. But, as long as it's what takes it for them. And... You know, and actually is what had them progress forward in their life to be a better person, to be that leader. I'm happy for them. And that's the thing, is that I offer help and assistance. And it always helps them in one way or another, each in their own different way. And like I say, I have an educational platform that has helped many of people out. But if a person leaves your business and seeks another, and then finds out, as long as they're not just jumping around, and finds and plants a flag there under one business, and becomes top earner like I did in a few weeks, then you know that they have found their spot. But we're all after the same goal, and that is bettering our lives, helping each other better their lives, and in the process, we may or may not enable getting profit from it. Ultimately, yes, I suppose, depending on what their reason of why they're doing it and their situation. But it can never be about making the money. It's how they can best give and have the tools and, and be able to connect with their inner passion. Different situations work for different people. So that's what I just wanted you guys to keep in mind. And uh, don't get all down and out and say, oh no, you know, what did I do? I, uh, you know, he went off and, and so forth. You know, as long as you're doing your job and I've seen people uh, take off in other systems and other streams of income and I'm not put out by it because I know that I set them on a path to success. And that's as plain and simple as that. So um, thank you very much. Please comment and subscribe if this resonates with you. Goodbye.